Hey guys, welcome back. Now we gotta talk to Anderson. What's her name? Aston? Anderson? Yeah, there we go. Uh, we gotta hear her bitchy voice again. Anybody else doing something over here? Pathfinder, do you have just a minute? Yeah, I do. Hi. The documentary's going great. Your comments really got people talking. By the way, Tan called us in for a talk about staying on message. Is everything okay? Oh, fine. And much less interesting than what you've been up to. The scientists are excited about your new outpost, though there are questions about how Prodromos can survive where Sites 1 and 2 failed. My team and I surveyed EOS thoroughly and even stopped the storms. The rest is up to the outpost, but the old threats are gone. Hopefully they can handle any new ones. Facing those risks must be stressful. How do you relax between missions? Oh, I hit the bar hard. My crew and I take downtime together. We're a team. This is history too, these little moments between. Shots of this remnant tech, some narration, that completes an episode. Thanks for stopping. Wish I, I can get a model. Please address concerns first with Director Addison. One must obey protocol. You have a job. If you want to keep it, do it. God damn it. You've shaken things up, Pathfinder. My department actually has colonial affairs to direct. And you have new tools to help grow the initiative. AVP, ready for spending. A bookkeeper. Sam said there was new functionality to discuss. It's how the initiative was designed to support the Pathfinder. You and your team are out there making Andromeda viable. That empowers all of us. Hit a threshold. A new cryo group can be brought out. Want more focus on research, like on Prodromos? That's your call. Brecker will introduce the interface and handle minutia. All you need to do is decide what life in Andromeda means. No pressure. Pathfinder. I have info on a specific sleeper I'd like brought out of cryo. I want to avoid that entirely. For reasons. Reasons. That's it? Look, you're the Pathfinder. If you've a request for your extended team, that's a request you can make. Access the sleeper records through Brecker's console. It's none of my business. Until you make it a problem for me. Understood? Hello again, Pathfinder. How has the Nexus reacted to the foothold I've established? We send them where you signal, because that's where the need is. There's no time for preference. Director Addison. Pathfinder. Commander Shepard. Any logistics updates are Hello, Pathfinder. I am Cryo Deployment Administrator Vladimir Breka, C-63 Galati. Your first task is to decide irrevocably the course of every life in the initiative. <laughs> You're kidding? Yes, of course. But now you respect what we're doing. Andromeda viability and Nexus thresholds are your tools, your reward, and our future. How can I help? Seems like he's off of uh, Dragon Age somewhere. So I decide what groups to wake up. Won't everyone be out eventually? Absolutely. But there's an order to things. A lines of support. You can't deploy an omelette without first deploying eggs. And eggs won't get you steak. Except it's people, and how all our lives begin. How are you measuring thresholds? It's based on resource estimates and general stability. A metric of acceptable scope and risk. The more you achieve, the greater capacity we can accommodate, the more the initiative can do for you. Simplest explanation? The more you do, the more room we have to grow. What's the rundown on AVP? Much of the preparation in the Milky Way was determining how to measure success. Thresholds are about capacity, but this is about cost, what we can actually afford to support. Points aren't the most elegant system, but it makes it clear. The more you earn, 
the more we can deploy. I deal in full colony blocks of specialists. I can make individual requests, but we should start the overall system first. All right, Brekka. Where do I start? The interface is active and will respond only to a Pathfinder. It's ready for your first selection. You may begin shaping the initiative at your leisure. Well, here we go. Which one are you gonna do? Um. <laughs> you gonna do one because I think later it unlocks some more. Only one view available right now. It's all folks good to drive your own car. <laughs> Burger ordered himself a pizza. Yeah. So I may go back to EOS to place that thing. So what else here? They open at nine and they close at two. Heard me free? Yeah, I heard you. Okay. I'm gonna close on weekdays. I mean, weekdays. Okay, let me know. So, yeah, I didn't know this. Guess what? Hmm? Pathfinder. You know, AVP leveling continues as per your what? directions. You know, you and, of course, the interface mm -hmm. remains accessible for any future adjustments. So Sweet like, protocol and process. Now we're living. Why'd you join the initiative? I was a teacher. A good life. I could see the positives and negatives right through to the end. You did the math and it said come to Andromeda? <laughs> no. I just didn't like being able to see the end. Here, I don't have a clue what tomorrow will bring. Feels more like living. What just happened? Good afternoon, Pathfinder. Or morning. I can keep time according to any of the worlds we've detected. Director Addison finds it annoying. <laughs> What's your take on the state of the initiative? Please consult the AVP interface. It has a thorough breakdown of your progress. And your personal opinion? Your progress thrills me. Make my job obsolete, Pathfinder. I dare you. <laughs> I have a specific person I want brought out of cryo. Name and designation if available. That's it? You'll just do it? Nowhere in my job description does it say, argue with the Pathfinder. That said, I record all interactions. Sorry. If something you ask for causes trouble, there will be no doubt that you're responsible. Yeah. <laughs> Let's keep this between us. Here's the info. Deployment will begin shortly. Is there anything else, Pathfinder? I have a specific person I want brought out of cry. Name and designation if available. I heard that the chief engineer on EOS went back into cryo. There have been a few such requests. The first few months in Helios were disheartening. Now that Prodromos is on track, I want her redeployed. Chief Engineer Grace Lito, designation E-97 Durango. Deployment will begin shortly. Is there anything else, Pathfinder? Why do some colonists have a number letter designation? 
all initiative members do. In a CV file somewhere, anyway. It isn't relevant when everyone is doing everything. I suppose it's like uh, caring about a middle name. Do you not know yours? I wasn't aware I had one. Hmm. You were in select company even before you were made Pathfinder. Rider Pathfinder. Specialist designation A03 Malapa. Hmm. Something interesting? An A and low odds. Hmm. Someone's an early adopter. Another time. Pathfinder. I like, oh yes. I had to go back to EOS to plant that thing down there. Excuse me. the loading screens and apparently said he did not murder him. intended for Prodromus was intercepted by those damned exiles. Scouts confirmed they've divvied the supplies up among their own outposts. I'll see what I can do about reclaiming them. That would be great. Thanks. Maybe when you come across them assholes, you can rectify all this. Harry, what's happening with Scott? Well, we got him out of the pod. I don't want to get your hopes up, but Sam managed to, uh, find him, you might say. I don't follow. Well, he's still in a coma, but he also has an implant like yours, and Sam managed to access it. He's made contact. That's incredible. He's okay? Vitals are steady. But I'm letting Sam take the lead on this one. Though in a coma, Scott's mental processes remain intact. So is he okay? You can ask him yourself. A moment while I establish a link with his implant. Proceed. Scott? Can you hear me? Is that you, sis? I don't understand. What's happening? There was a problem with your stasis pod. You're in a coma on the Hyperion. Do you understand? Wow, really? How are we talking? Sam linked into your implant, but they say you're stable. 
You're safe and sound in the med bay. Guess I'll take your word for it. I can't feel anything, but I still hear you. Is Dad okay? I'm not sure how to say this, but he's dead, Scott. What? There was an accident. What do you mean? Accident? How? I mean, Dad. I know. It was all very sudden. Nothing anyone could do. I don't believe it. I'm sure he'd want to be here now. Did we at least find home? Dad kept talking about how amazing it would be. There's been some complications. The Golden Worlds didn't exactly deliver. I don't understand. I thought... Scott? This is... This is all wrong. This... is a nightmare. Scott, it's okay. I, I didn't mean to. His pulse rate is increasing rapidly. I don't feel well. That's enough for now. He needs to rest. Scott. Ryder, that was a hell of a thing talking to your brother in a coma. Can't say I really bought into the whole Sam implant, but well, that was pretty amazing. I don't know. The whole thing was strange. I know what you mean, but everything seems weird at first. There was a time when my profession thought germs were a crazy idea. It just takes getting used to, and if it can help my patients, I'll keep an open mind. So, you and Lexi swapped jobs? Yeah, you know that moment when you right. realize you're just getting too old? Uh... Ha, <laughs> right, look oh. who I'm talking to. Trust me, it happens. For me, it was Habitat oh. 7. Watching you guys running around, dodging lightning and the cat, it's a young man's game. Pains me to admit it, but it's passed me by. So it made sense that Lexi and I switched places. She's younger. Well, for a sorry. They're still teenagers when they're 200. And she's one hell of a doctor. She'll serve the Tempest well. Oh, Assholes! So this was the true the mommy uh, from the book or whatever it was. Oh, really? Mhm. Mm the one we were used to was a different one. Mom said she found forty-five dollars. <laughs> <laughs> That's all, Harry. Thanks. I'll be here if you need me. Yeah, Barker always seemed to be at that type of thing. Leave the door open if you want. Yeah, kind of warm in here. Oh, evil. I don't know. 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 I don't
Some girls say she thought he sounded like an old man. What guy said, well, people uh, protect people's voices a different way. Oh, Some girl thought he sounded like, sound like a, um. Old man? Mm-hmm. Hell no. Oh, the ship manual's useful. That leg of my workbench needed propping up. If you bothered reading it, you'd know that the Tempest is an orchestra of new tech. You can't just meddle with On it. I got this ship store, launch ready in record time, Callo. I know my stuff. And you don't have a shred of respect for other people's. Callo. Oh, Ryder. Sorry you had to hear that. <laughs> what can I do for you? I'll let you concentrate. You know where I'll be. Away. Oh, yeah, the Krogan Betrayal. Just a minute, I'll return back when I get back to, um, yes. I like that sound. Doon, doon. Missed that. Going back to yours. stupid they they yell at kids for just fishing that don't make any sense to me like man they could be doing so much worse than just fishing man mm -mm. Well, that, that, that ticks me off so no fishing here like you don't like it when kids are fishing instead of making a lot of racket okay you guys are stupid I thought I got a new one. Mm, look at that, that's not new. Yo, I like the way you just come walking out, like, yeah. <laughs> I've located a suitable site for an HNS receiver, Pathfinder. Now point is set. Oh no, Spider-Man! Rider. Hey. 
Pathfinder? Darkit Tervian. I understand I was pulled from Cryo ahead of schedule. My family is grateful, but I consider it my debt. Everyone gets out eventually. That may be, but the least I can do is show you the benefit. I'm Exo Studies now, but in a former life, let's say I knew tactics. If I supplied the Ket on this planet, I'd drift it in. And there's only so many gravitational paths. Here's some navs to check for anomalies. Good hunting, Pathfinder. Still think you'd be better off with soldiers at your outpost. Yeah, maybe. None of this planet. Pathfinder. Hey. Need a hand? Wondering. Ooh, that thing's far away. Where is oh? levels. Loot from our outposts and an arc escape pod. Where'd they get that? They're not keeping it. We need an up-close scan. Yeah, sucker. Gets us away from the sun for a while. These caves could be a good shelter if people need it. Never like the caves. Too many carkins in your sleeping bag. Say 
what the heck is that? Getting to know someone helps you like them. Yeah, any more stuff in here? Mm. Yeah, the calcium thing. Calium. Looks like they found it drifting and brought it here. I'm not able to extrapolate point of origin, Pathfinder. I wonder if the Ark survived. Let's hope so. So we can't get up there yet. Go oh, into the radiation goes down again. Oh really? Okay, um Pathfinder, this area can be mined for resources. You can extract minerals via your mining interface. Radiation levels within acceptable limits. Life support is stable. Yeah, well before the radiation goes down, so let's get out of here. Rider. Yes. Anomaly on sensors. Pro 
the way. Getting a scan. Our Turian friend on Eos has good instincts. Let's check it out. Oh, shit! Oh, that's scary. What the hell? They tried to push him off his bike while he was going in that speed. Their ships look weird as heck though. I'm picking up something. Deploying probe. Getting a scan. Possible cat supplies, just like Dark had suggested. I did that.
under a tree yet. There it is. Oh, this tree's not it. Unless he's talking about, about that new planet. the lights from site two. One night, nothing. <laughs> so what's in here? <laughs> Would have stood a better chance if they had a Krogan. <laughs> no offense, big guy, but I don't think that would have changed this. <laughs> Depends on the Krogan. Schematics for Special Project Sigma. They were building something, but there are parts missing. This must be the project they were salvaging at Site 1. A way to fight the cat. It'd be swell if it was finished. All components at Site 2 had security tags, compiling possible nap points. Why are they showing me the wrong thing? Resilience, promise, or like death and starvation. Well, I know who's not naming our next outpost. Got a component for Site 2's project. Of course. <laughs> Of course it's uh, far away from the place. Back to the next. The nomad. Whoa, Barney can calm down. Hear the raid tree though. What? Yeah, you're supposed to have given them more room like a car. It's past the ball, it's pretty funny. Radiation levels have spiked, Pathfinder. Now, when y'all start hitting and trying to open the door, of course they drive off because they're scared. shuttles ahead lost a few of those worth checking if only to make sure the cat don't get to keep it all site 2 components are accounted for let's head to site 2's research station and see what good they do Plug it in, plug it in. 
civilians lived here, engineers, but they fought. This was theirs for a while. Radiation levels within acceptable limits. Go like, whoops, wrong way. Search station can put them together. Well, we can get out of here until the radiation is done. I mean, radiation goes down a bit before we explore more of the planet. Next up, we're gonna head to the Nexus to do um, our Krogan dude's um, side quest. Did we head to the next poster with the ne next main camp plan? I think. What the hell? See you guys next time. <laughs>